3x lex all right guys back in the building 3x lex for 3x tech here today to uh show off have a another episode really a short episode of real talk and get your opinions on a few things um this what you're looking at this is a 55 uh that's in progress haven't been wrapped yet haven't done the control panel yet but the cabinet is pretty much there this one has what i wanted to ask you guys about this one has a complete uh enclosed marquee up top without the usual dragon points of this of the uh sword sticking up so i'm curious as to which look do you guys like better just the closed off marquee or the actual points on the top you know with the marquee in between i'd be curious on knowing which that you prefer you know i'd be curious on getting your opinion on that other than that um this bad boy is coming along good the 55 man it's it's a real big machine um it's a nice ass machine it's not terribly bigger than the 50 though to be honest i mean it is only five inches bigger I know that 65 is going to be something <laughs> for the books. That's going to be really big. Uh, been doing a lot of measuring with the control panel. This one has the 24-inch um, control panel, too. It's a deep control panel. To give you a, a breakdown of how deep the control panel is, uh, yeah, that's what we're dealing with there, guys. So as you can see, it's super deep. And... Um, Again, this one's in a buff. It hasn't been wrapped. It's not done yet, but, you know, I just got around to uh, putting in some work on this right here. So, yeah, I'd be interested in getting your uh, opinions on the marquee as if either if you guys have a different opinion on each uh, each of the other, each other, each of the different marquees and which you actually prefer. Sorry about that. Which one you actually prefer. Thank you. I'd be interested in uh, getting your opinion on that. Uh, other than that, um, you know, I'm just having a blast uh, doing a lot of the game testing and just playing all of the different games on here on this particular uh, Dragon Slayer. You know, this is just a base model here, a uh, base stereo, uh, but it's got the platinum armor added. So, you know, it's got the, the base Android tablet and the base PC, and just even with that, and this is like the base build, hey, I'm having a, a ball with this system, you know, uh, just having a ball with it, so it's a lot of value, uh, you know, that system, that combination is is well under 2000 before any options, and there's nothing else out there like this, guys, so, you know, being able to switch over, play PC games, switch over, play tablet games and then switch over to the emulation this is just there's nothing out there like this this is just a complete ball and it's unlimited gaming it's too much gaming to be honest so anyway uh i'm gonna be making a video soon i want to get into my deep into my experiences on using um retro pi and uh single board computers like the pi 4 versus using actual PCs and the actual advantages to going to a PC. I want to touch on that. I'm a guy that's in the last, I want to say, eight to, I will say six to nine months. I've done an incredible amount of research on many PCs, PCs, single board computers, pretty much everything computing top to bottom, building everything. So I have a lot of opinions on that. I've used a lot of Pi builds, uh, Ojoy builds. Uh, I definitely want to talk about that. Going to get into deep the advantages of, of actual running a full PC, how it affects the emulation, and also uh, the, the, the response of just the overall general responsiveness of the um pc versus just using a standard raspberry pi so anyway guys be on the lookout for that soon um of course i'm going to be posting 
more videos showing off the games. Just wanted to have a quick chat and get your opinions on the marquees. Anyway, 3XLX out. Peace.